Welcome back to our Point Reyes tour from 2019. This is the Point Reyes hostel we stayed in, which was a real quaint spot. The morning coffee views were pretty awesome, and I wanted to get more footage of the kitchen and shared spaces, which were really nice, but I didn't want to encroach on people's space. This here is the private room, which felt more like a converted group room, but still nice because we were sleeping in the boy-only, girl-only dorms for the last couple nights, and it was nice to have our own space. The following morning, we headed out to do the Coast Trail to Fire Lane Trail and Laguna Loop, which we decided to do in reverse. Back there. Back there. Point Reyes. <laughs> the Laguna, what is it? The Laguna Coast Fire Trail? Yeah. It's number, I think it's number nine in the book. It's right by our hostel, so we just had to step outside our hostel door and then just walk to the trailhead and here we are. It's also in uh, Bay Area Best Hikes. This is number four. Number four for us. Look at us, we're just moving yes. along. This one is noted as one of the best uh, hikes in the Bay Area to see redwood trees. This one? Yeah. This one and then that 13 miler one is. So yeah, so we're gonna see some great redwoods hopefully. Poop! Stay tuned. <laughs> The hike travels over the coastal hills leading to the Santa Maria Beach, where you can choose to spend the night at the Coast Camp Campground. The Laguna section is only 0.8 miles before hitting the Fire Lane Trail. There was plenty of wildlife to be seen. We even spotted a few snakes cruising around on the trail. Shortly after, we stayed right to connect to the Fire Lane Trail for about a mile heading towards the Coast Camp. If you're backpacking, you can reserve a spot at the Coast Camp Campground at recreation.gov for around $20. If you are considering Coast Camp, I think it's a great trip to bring the little ones, especially if you're looking for some starter trails to get them into backpacking. From Coast Camp, it's a short walk to the Santa Maria Beach. If you've got the time, it's definitely worth hanging out for the afternoon. After we enjoyed the beach for a bit, we continued to the Coast Trail. This section is more of a wide dirt road, slightly uphill but not taxing. I think the book has it right for knocking out this section early on instead of saving it for the end. I felt like the Santa Maria Beach is sort of the highlight of this loop, where finishing on the Coast Trail just kind of felt long and dragged out. We did it. We did it. So this is definitely not a trail with redwoods. As I said before, <laughs> I think I was mistaken. No redwoods, but super nice coast views. You walk along the coast. Some of that beach. Yeah, that's an easy one. Yeah, it's not too bad. And then you should you should stay at this Point Reyes hostel if you come out. It's right across the street. Right. It's very nice. And uh, you've got access to all these trailheads. So not a bad deal. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you on the next one.